Alright guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming and today I'm going to show you guys how you guys can recover actual deleted files alright, for completely free. So like I said, this thing is completely free. Alright, So if you guys have watched a lot of videos out there, right, most of them, you know, teaches you about how to recover files, how to recover software. Most of them, you know, they require you to pay for it for the software or two, it's kind of like, it's, although it's free, but it's a gimmicky software. What do I mean by that is most of the time, uh, you, they only recovers from recycled bins. So, you know, it's, it doesn't really know what you really need. All right, but today is the actual recover that can recover your deleted files, even if deleted from recycled bins. So there's no way of taking it back, all right? With this software, you can actually recover it back. And the best part about this is this is 100% free. So you don't have to pay a single cent to use this. All right, and it is with the help of this software right here so this is the win fr gui or for long form it means all right a uh, windows file recovery graphical user interface <laughs> okay so um what do i mean by that all right so this thing actually make use based on the windows file recovery uh, tool that is available that is built into windows but if you know but if you guys know all right um the windows file recovery that was built into windows you have to use it through command prompts and most of you probably wouldn't like to use in common prompts because you guys are not really tech savvy or you really have much experience how to do that and it's very very confusing all right because let me just show you one of it right so this is the uh, windows file recovery winfr all right and um yeah you guys can see it's, it's you have to use like command lines and you know you have to use like all these slashes to find like where you want to recover and it's, it's and it's all like bits and day data you can see all this all right so it's very very hard for you to actually recover the files so that's why they have this software right here which based on that all right they built a graphical user interface and it's really free so you don't have to pay a single cent just download it for free all right and instead of like command line all right it will show a graphical user interface for you to easily navigate around and recover your files so right now i'm going to demonstrate how good this um this software is all right so let me just go ahead and show you the software itself all right so this is the software itself as you guys can see all right over here is is a graphical user interface so you can can uh, select where you want to save your uh, recovered files to you can do a quick scan or a deep scan obviously quick scan will be much faster than a deep scan and you can see all your drives over here they also even have advanced settings so you guys can um, recover a certain type of file so if you like are looking to just recover your text document you can just select document and they will only scan for files that is deleted and it's documents all right so you can specifically so you will save a lot of scanning time as well all right so so yeah so right now let me just go ahead and show you the file all right so i have this important file which is in my usb d drive i right, guess you can see right over here okay so this is the important files inside my d drive all right so you guys can see inside here contain a pdf document all right you guys can see all right and um i have some excel files uh, because my Microsoft Excel is not working, so I cannot open this file. But it's an Excel file over here. We have a thumbnail image. This is what I did for the plot AI at that time. All right. We have an image over here and a very important text document. All right. All right. Um, so these are all right over here. And, you know, it's pretty important, right? So right now, I'm going to... So guys, just remember the name all right, of all these files. All right. And I'm going to delete it right now. So I'm. Mean, this is the folder. This is a USB drive D. I'm inside the drive D. This is a folder. I'm gonna just click on delete. All right, delete. What? Oh, gone. All right. So let me just open my recycle bin for you guys to see. All right. And um, yeah, there is don't have any of the files caught there. All right. I'm. I'm also just empty my recycle bin for you to see. So my recycle bin now is completely empty. All right. If I go to my D drive now. All right. You can see my D drive is empty. So there is no way of recovering this files back. So how? Well, how am I gonna do that? Well. Just use the WinFR GUI. So all I have to do is just select my disk drive. All right, where I want to save to. I'm gonna just put C for for now. All right, let's do a quick scan. All right, because I just deleted it recently. You can do a deep scan if you probably deleted the file probably long time ago. But since I it's just a fresh delete, just a quick scan should be able to find it back. All right, I just click on Start Recovering, and they have found 15 files, so I can view my recovered files. All right, and that is all the files that it was right here. So you guys can see this is the folder right over here. This is the important files. All right, and this it have been recovered right over here. It includes some of the old files that I have that is deleted uh, some time ago. I think this is a C16S. This is the MR3 video. You guys watch the Edifier. So yeah, these are the video, um, the files to the video I did about one month ago. So it's, it's still inside here. It's still so considered fresh. All right, but yeah, this is the important files. And you guys can see all the files that are recently deleted is all over here and it can be opened so you can see right 
Yep, they can all be open. Hello. So yeah, it's really, really useful. All right, and you can see they have also found a lot of other files that is also recently deleted. So it's really, really a useful tool, right, for you to recover all your recovered files. So it will automatically save to your to your drive. So it's that simple. It's so simple. You don't have to like. You know, look through everything and you can do a deep scan as well. You'll find like older files. So that's not a quick scan. So if you have older files, let's just do a deep scan. So deep scan will probably take quite a longer time because, you know, it's scanning every single bit of data, all right, in your drive. All right. So it's, it's, it, will, it will scan all the bits of data, every single bit, every data that have ever existed in the drive, all right, it will be scanned. So it will be it will recover like from many, many, many years ago. All right, but um, I'm not gonna waste my time scanning this. All right, so I'm gonna stop for now, okay? So yeah, if you guys want to find a file that has been deleted a long time ago, you guys can use the deep scan function. But like I say, all right, I just use the recent one and it's able to recover, all right, all the files that are actually deleted and there's no way of recovering back, all right, even in my recycle bin. So my recycle bin is empty, so there's no way of recovering back. But with this recovery tool, you can actually recover it for completely free. And you know, and it's so easy. You don't have to like, you know, you don't that because like I said, it's completely free. You don't. They don't even need like for you to like buy membership and it supports so many different languages. So if you like used to like Korean, you know, you have Korean as well, so easy to switch, alright? And they have like a lot of they can translate, they can translate as well, you can check for update and you don't even need a license or to purchase anything. You can just download it. Alright. In the first link in the video description down below, download it and you guys can get back all the files that you recently recovered. So it is very, very awesome. Alright, and um yeah, like I say this is this is really really an awesome free tool that you can do it for free at the comfort of your own home. So yeah, this is the Windows recovery, uh, sorry, Windows file recovery graphical user interface software that helps you recover your files. And you guys want to check out this software right here? You guys can check out the first link in the video, down, the video description down below, and go ahead and download this for completely free. And the best part about this is you can do it at the comfort of your own home, your own time, alright, without worrying about your, you know, your privacy getting stolen. Because most of the time, if you send this kind of like, maybe you send your drive or your SD card or your external storage to a, like a data recovery shop, alright, they can recover for you for sure. They probably also use the same software, alright, and they can probably see all the data that you had before. So, one, your privacy is not secured. All right, two, they can steal all your information without you knowing that. All right, and three, you have to pay a large sum of money. Usually, they will you will pay in the hundreds to two hundred dollar range. Where you can do this at the in the comfort of your own home for free without getting your privacy stolen. So this is a really really amazing tool. So once again, if you want to check out this software right here, I will link them the first link in the video description down below. I right, for you to check it out. And one thing I forgot to mention that this thing can also recover all kinds of file format. So you don't have to worry about like certain file format that is unrecoverable. Right, most of the common mouth file format can be recovered and support all kinds of um, storage option like XFAT, NTFS, and um, a lot, a lot, a lot of different kind of file format, file system, it can be used as well. So yeah, that's all for today, guys. If you find today's video really interesting and really helpful, I right, hope you save tons of money and recover found, do give it a thumbs up and leave it in the comment section down below. So yeah, that's all for today, guys. And this is GeForce Gaming. I shall see you guys in my next video. Peace out. I don't wanna cry.